Alright, this video is going to show you how to mod uh, offline gamer tags. Um, first, uh, oh yeah, we're going to be using a USB once again. Uh, so, if you haven't watched my other videos, go watch those. Um, they kind of lay out the basics of how to use a USB, like the first video, how to mod split screen. But um, basically, you're going to want to plug your USB into your Xbox, uh, click the middle button, click sign in, or no, yeah, click sign in, and then create a new profile. And then when you're creating it and it asks you where to save it, save it onto your flash drive. So I'm going to do that right now. I'm just going to save it to the memory unit, which is the flash drive. And I'm just going to name it USB. And this is for offline, so yeah. And then just yeah. So once that's done, you can take out your USB and plug it into your. Uh, oh wait, first you have to sign out before you take it out. Before you take out the USB, sign out of your gamer tag, and then you can take it out of your USB. Plug it into your computer. and then open up USB Explorer click file open device and then you should have uh, if it's a brand new flash drive you should have one but um, you're gonna have to find it uh, this is my Xbox Live Gamer one and this is my uh, modded gamer because I found out how to mod uh, Xbox Live Gamer Tags which will be my next video I thought this was going to be the last one but I found out how to f uh, mod Xbox Live Gamer Tags using USB um, anyways uh, offline so this is my offline profile I just created I know this because I already knew what these two were so yeah it'd probably be easier if you cleaned it out like clean out so it's a brand new flash drive and then you can find it way easier. But um, you go through these, you go through these files. So you just click it, click this FFF, click zero 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 one, whatever. And then this is your profile right here. You're gonna extract that to your desktop. Okay, so there it is. And uh, now you have to open up uh, Mario I'll put this in the link description and you can just drag your file into Mario oops okay see as you can see it, sh it shows your profile name right here I named it USB and then um so yeah you're gonna go to the right and click file contents and then right here your where it says account that's like your account basically so you're gonna extract that file to your desktop um alright uh, save alright now that's extracted um you're gonna open up a file called siggy I'll put this in the download download uh I mean the description to download this siggy you just run it um, you might have to run as admin if you have Windows Vista or Windows 7. I'm not sure because about Windows 7 because I don't. I'm not running Windows 7. I'm running Windows Vista. Um, all right, so you're gonna open Siggy. You're gonna click decrypt right here. You're gonna click decrypt, and you're gonna click the account that you extracted right here. Account. It says decryption successful. Press OK, and then uh, you're gonna have to open hxd um, basically a hex editor I guess you can use any hex editor um, I'm using hxd I'll post that in the description as well um, but you can just drag it into hxd and then there is your USB um, for offline gamer tags you can you can only mod it to 15 letters still um, I don't think you can go any higher uh, 
I tried it and if you try to go more than 15 letters uh, it's gonna say corrupted file so make sure it's in in like uh, make sure it's 15 letters basically so I'm just gonna name it uh, uh, also uh, what's it called I have the buttons here post this in the uh, in the description you can change your name uh, using these but when you use them make sure like if you want the A button find it find where you want it like if I want to replace the U with the A button I have to go over here to where these val values are I think they're called values and you're gonna have to like highlight that and then a button is zero one, so you're gonna have to do zero one, and it changes it to like a dot, like a normal, like the rest of these. So that's the A button. Um, I'll change the S with uh, the B button, which is zero two. So copy this and click zero two. So uh, there's that. Um, and for colors, you have to go to the side so for B um, I'm gonna change it to red orange but if you watch what I do right here I click the little up sign thing and then I skip a skip a dot like when you do these you have to make sure you skip dots because if you don't skip dots um, it's gonna be corrupted I think so just make sure you skip dots because you don't want to mess anything up and so you put the little carrot sign skip a dot and then the number that you want so I'll say I'll do um I'll do black um so eight so I'm just gonna put put eight and then you can start writing your word that you want I'll put USB so you skip a dot s skip a dot b so now it should be A B U S B. Um and if you want spaces just go to the um skip a dot and then just press space and it should look like that. And then um when if you mess up, do not press backspace because if you press backspace it'll say that. This operation changes the file size. So don't do that. Don't do that. Just click cancel. Um press uh press control Z and it should go back to normal without having to backspace so just in case you mess up so just remember that and um so yeah that's it so my gamer tag should be a b and then black usb um this counts as letters so it'd be one two three four five six seven it's so already used seven letters just just by doing that so colors cost you letters which kind of sucks and limits your like limits the name that you want basically but once you're done with that file save exit that out um and then back to siggy you have to go back to siggy click encrypt and then click account and then encrypted successfully back to Mario um I hope you didn't close it out cause it's easier if you didn't close it out but so you're gonna want to open up your USB again, file contents, account, and then you're gonna replace the file. If you have the newest version of Mario, um, yeah, it's gonna look different than the old versions if you still have old versions. So replace file or overwrite. Um, then just click account, the one that you modded. Open, and then it should be all good. Then rehash and resign. And then exit out of your profile don't exit out of Mario because you might want to go back and change some things and then uh, open up USB and delete your one that's in USB delete and then move your new one into USB then you can exit out but I wish you guys luck um, my next video will be showing how to mod Xbox Live Gamer Tags because I found that out uh, so yeah, subscribe.